LPG gang, what's happening? Let's do a kind of sort of singles reading. This is going to be for singles and situationships and all that, okay? I did another one for you guys, but there was no sound, okay? So, here we are, collective. Take what resonates, leave the rest. Take it how it resonates with you and your situation. If you need a personal reading, take the description box. Two question readings are available for a limited time. Um, you guys, so there's a separate link for that in the description box, okay? Um, if your coins ain't there, that's fine. No fret, okay? Um, check out Kane five minutes for one dollar, okay? You got options, all right? If you need a little bit more clarity, you got options, okay? Let's see what's going on here. Um, I'm seeing uh, the tapped out. So some of you are tapped out from something. Socialize. And then we have children here on the bottom. Okay, so let's see what show it says. This is express your true feelings. Be clear about your intentions and honest about what you want. The, the potential reward is worth the risk. So I kind of talk about that in uh, the Gemini reading today as well. So we have socialize. It's be social, make friends, and date until you meet the one who makes you stop looking for anyone else. Love that. Love that. Um, and then we have children here. Parenting is a significant and ongoing responsibility that can affect your love life, okay? So um, we'll see what that children is about. Some of you have children um, or whatnot, but let's see. Some of you feel like you can't date because of your children or somebody in your energy. Six of Swords, yeah, Seven of Wands, mm-hmm. Okay, ooh, we got the Emperor and uh, the Death card here. So, interesting. Some of you, do you have children with a person that's trying to, like, come back and reconcile or somebody? Why do I keep, why do I keep seeing this Four of Cups? Um, <laughs> the judgment here on the bottom, yeah, I've seen that four cups several times today. I don't know. I don't like it. Okay, so what the hell? Okay, I'm not gonna take any of these, but um, I'm seeing the seven of swords here and the six of pentacles. I'm seeing the three of swords, the ten of cups, and the knight of pentacles. So I feel like with this, do you have some? I feel like some of you guys may have somebody you have a family with that is wanting to reconcile. Some of you may be divorced from someone or you want a divorce. That's not gonna be, it's not gonna resonate with all of you. Some of you may have a, a, a divorce coming or you're gonna meet somebody that's going through a divorce uh, or something like that. This person may be like a little bit like non-committal too. Let's see what, what's going on. I'm already confused to collective. I'm already confused. What is going on here? Okay, King of Swords. Okay, the Magician here on the bottom. I saw this card in the same exact placement in another reading. Okay, I'm also seeing the Four of Cups here on the bottom of this deck uh, as well. So I feel like there may be someone that is a little bit uh, fixated on you. Um, or this is Spirit telling you to like get out there and, and not... Uh, take your focus off of someone um, collective this could go either way let's see what what it leans more towards though because um, the six of swords over here though with the seven of wands it makes me feel like um, your healing and your guard might be up a little bit and you know spirit might be telling you to to uh you know scope out your your options a little bit better like because there may be something that you're missing or something that you're you're not paying attention to you may have even rejected someone that uh, might be for you okay ten of wands here yeah oh some of you have oh what is going on so i'm seeing the nine of swords here the three of swords the king of cups you know seeing this again some of you may have more than one energy here some of you have, some of you have um, more than one person here. Mm -hmm. Could be a, a one water, one air, air sign. Oh goodness. Some of you are dating. There may be somebody here that isn't happy about you dating and enjoying yourself and seeing what else is out there as well. 
Somebody's really fixated on you too. Hope that devil don't come out. Mm -hmm. Yep, there's a lover's card. Could be a Gemini. Wow. The Ten of Cups. <laughs> The nine of wands. Yeah, interesting. Uh, listen, collective. Yeah, you have somebody. If if this is one of your options, take this how it resonates. Okay, this could be. This could go either way. The one way is some of you are dating. You have options, or you have one that is really, really, like stepping up to the plate. Others of you, this may be somebody that you dated at one point and, and wants to come back around um to kind of like fight for y'all's connection because someone is like really fixated on having a family with you having children with you for some of you this is already a thing like you already were married to this person you already have children with this person and they're like fighting for their family or fighting for this dynamic okay so take that how it resonates uh nine of wands it's this it gives like something somebody not ready to give up or not wanting to give up um on the connection yeah two of cups here on the bottom mm -hmm. so yeah so if you are dating and you have multiple options could be a leo <laughs> you're dating you have multiple oh, wow the hangman <laughs> the hierophant yeah the eight of swords baby listen um yeah where this is just once you to stick by them i told you some of you guys are married to this person some of you already married and or you want to divorce you're getting a divorce or you want a divorce some of you are are in separation from someone and you started seeing someone else and they know about it um, others of you this isn't someone you were married to this could just be someone that they had planned somebody had y'all's life like planned out to a t and they're stuck on that. Somebody is stuck on um, the life that they planned in their mind for you and them. Okay? Um, and they're not willing to let that go. Someone's not willing to let go of the life that they created, <laughs> the magician, in their mind for you and them. And if this is a new person, I feel like if this hasn't already happened, one of your options or your options, some of you have more than one option. Take it how it resonates. One of your options is really about to step up. And I mean, really, they're about to be really, really, really pursuing you and like landing on thick um, because I feel like they they don't want to like lose out on on you and the connection. Because like I said, Somebody is set on having this forever with you. Like you're somebody's happily ever after. And in their mind, it's it's already a thing. <laughs> now, collective, what did you do to this individual? Because, um, yeah. <laughs> now, this could be, you know, someone that you could have left behind. Like I said, I would see if you're getting a divorce, there's a reason why. Um, you know, you're divorcing this person, but there's there's something here is that you left behind um, or you want to leave behind, but they're not really. And for others of you, it's not somebody you left. It's just one of your options um, that is kind of territorial over you. And this person, even if they are dating other people, especially if you're single and if they, they are dating other people like you are this person's like. I don't want to say target because target sounds so predatory <laughs> but you're this person's like option like top option or whatever uh somebody is very like fixated on you stuck on you oh 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 collective collective could be a sash or some of you knight of wands the five of swords and the tower oh oh I told you. <laughs> oh man, oh man. Mm, mm, mm. I feel like something's about to hit the fan. For some of you, yeah. This is somebody really, 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 really about to like defend the connection or like, like I said, this person wants to stand out from anybody else you could be possibly dating. Okay. Um, Lordy, lordy, lordy. <sighs> yeah. 
I feel like you you tried to yeah nine of pentacles you moved away from someone um to try to get like well obviously to get away from them but like for your own good or for like your own um sanity okay now others of you again if this is a new person this could simply be like you went through some type of healing process beforehand this person may also trigger you too or you trigger this person um as well yeah wow y'all queen of pentacles could be a, a capricorn for some of you somebody is fixated on you it, it's like that you're you're playing a b c and d to this person and again you may have more see i'm spitting the deck the magician i feel like you guys somebody has created in their mind this happily ever after for you too okay and that's just what it is that's it that's all but i feel like for some of you um it, the 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 3d isn't reflecting what this person is feeling and wanting in the 5d so i feel like they're about to let something be known whether it be their intentions whether it be the fact that they don't want you dating anyone else they don't want you socializing with anyone else okay ciao don't meet no crazy folks i don't get necessarily crazy though but i do get um i do get i'm not gonna take any of these but i'm seeing a knight of pentacles it's just too many that flipped over too many too many cards flipped over um the knight of pentacles is on the top so that makes sense that makes perfect sense um yeah wow okay the knight of swords yeah <laughs> The moon here on the bottom so like i said uh collective i feel like somebody wants children yep split in the deck i'm seeing the six of cups i feel like somebody wants children five of wands um yeah somebody sees you as their everything pretty much um and i feel like they're gonna let it be known someone's gonna let it be known also get to like somebody trying to rush this so you don't end up with somebody else or you know having a family with someone else having children with someone else like this is this gives somebody like trying to like claim their spot in your life collective and i mean in a massive way the tower is here you guys what is really going on what is really going on here um and like i said some of you may have even more than one energy here that uh, is is wanting to like cuff you collective i don't know you just you just looking real good the energy you coming off is as a dope vibe and you know this queen of pentacles might be you or how this person wants to treat you um but somebody is super fixated on you it's like I, I'm, I'm hearing it, it you're as good as it gets like this is what this person um feels okay and there is no other option for this person it doesn't matter if they you know chit chat or have their little uh, rendezvous or whatever the case may be like there is no plan b for this person you are plan a plan b plan c plan d you are the plan collective okay and i feel like for some of you or most of you they're about to let that be known i feel like a lot of you guys too if you end up in a connection there could be children that pop up very quickly so um if that's not what you're wanting i would be careful okay mm -hmm. all right and also don't let anyone like pressure you into um doing anything or whatever but i feel like y'all have a little bit more sense than that all right but yeah um i feel like someone may be trying to hurry up and like cuff you so you know someone else doesn't get you if that makes sense somebody if somebody's trying to trying to mm, yeah <laughs> long road here so what flipped up over is court official okay so we have um I'm trying to see what what actually works with this court official lawyer judge mediator counselor um doctor resolution okay that makes sense resolution therapist um yeah that's that's the only thing that makes sense to me is the resolution Especially if this is someone that you you didn't get along with or you're not getting along with right now. 
uh, collective. So that makes sense. <laughs> Rich lady, that's it's it's giving heavy queen of pentacles. Um, and again, this could be something that, or, or some way that this person sees you. They just see you as very prosperous, abundant, and again, it may be more than one person that sees you this way. Wealth, ease, youth, health, beauty, charm, lavish lifestyle, luxury, fun, good life, and privilege. If somebody just kind of sees you like that, and that could be why they're trying to hold on to you too. Um, because you're just that guy or that gal. I mean, hey, what can you say? <laughs> okay, hold on, y'all. Yep. <laughs> Okay, so this fell out face down. This is the sorrow. We'll see if it comes out again. But again, ooh, ooh, look at this. Okay, so we have military person. So what this is could be in the military. Um, or they just have that personality for a military. Okay, so this is military member, veteran, authority, discipline, rule follower, compliant government. See, government was on this too. Some of you, this person may work with the government um, or something like that. Um intelligence and strategic and then we have rich man here on the bottom okay success businessman investor entrepreneur business acumen strategic again and networker okay so um let me get a couple of songs or just one song because now i'm curious uh singles because that was a little bit interesting <laughs> let's see uh Oh my goodness. Okay, She's Worth the Trouble by Jay Valentine. <laughs> this song always cracks me up. Y'all yeah, listen to her She's Worth the Trouble by Jay Valentine because yeah, that song always cracks me up. Um, right in a Wrong Way by Mario, but the original singer of this song is Key Sweat, so Right in a Wrong Way, um, y'all can listen to. Okay. Um, but thank you, Collective, for watching, y'all. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. I appreciate y'all. Peace out.